Trinden is revealing a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to start an online business and work from home and how complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More at that after the intro. <laughs> Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop where it's the fast and easiest way to make money online. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so check it out now. All right guys, so check out this blog article that I made. Before building my YouTube channel and blog to over 200,000 subscribers, before visiting over 25 plus different countries and living there while working from home and making money online, as well as like writing the book on side hustles, as you can see right there, there was literally a point in my life where I had no idea what to do with anything, right? Because I'm not the smartest person in the world when it comes to business because my background was biology, chemistry, and math and science. But yet, I was able to figure out ways to go ahead and, for example, start an online business and work from home. And then when I started working from home, I realized why do I have to stay at home when I'm making money online and all my friends are working at a job when I could literally now take this money and time freedom to literally go ahead and travel around the world. So as you can see, I literally grabbed my ukulele, started traveling around the world. Um, here's me with like monkeys and like with the people that I care about and even like doing events where you know I shared this with people also exactly what I learned because of the fact that the simple stupid concepts that allowed me, someone who's not the smartest person in the world to go ahead and do this, was able to go ahead and build online businesses and work from home. As you can see, I'm literally here. Like there's my kitchen, there's my dog. Wait, no, that's my, my dog's upstairs. I mean, there's like literally my couches. There's nothing special about me. There's no Lambos. There's no, there's no mansion. It's literally just me like working from home, making my online business, but still going from zero to eight grand in 30 days. Another business going from zero to five grand in 30 days and 1.6 million that first year. Another business pulls in like, for example, 35 grand to 46 grand a month. All this is validated on my blog, by the way. Another business pulled in $346,000 in that commissions. And like I said, like I don't say this to brag or to impress you, but to impress upon you that if someone like me could go ahead and do this, with no business sales marketing background bone in my body, then what's stopping you from at least, you know, making a hundred dollars a day or two hundred dollars a day or five thousand dollars a month? Like for me, I didn't care about making millions of dollars. I just thought if I could start an online business and make a hundred dollars a day, five thousand dollars a month, I do not have to work for somebody who doesn't actually treat me what I'm worth. I don't have to go ahead and stay in a, the same city, state, and country if I want to go ahead and leave. I don't have to wait until I'm 65 to retire and actually live the life that I want with the people that I care about. I could do that now because the time to live is now, okay? Not, not decades in the future, which isn't promised, but in this present moment. And starting an online business literally would change my life. So what are some of the ways that I did to literally start making money working from home so I did not have to go ahead and go to a job? Well, one of the first things that I needed to realize is I'm in an environment that isn't really conducive to start an online business. Why? Because I'm literally asking advice from my friends and my family that never started an online business. That's like me going ahead and, for example, asking you know, someone who's obese or overweight on how to get a six pack. If I'm spending around my time with all these people that are like obese and overweight and I, and I wanna get a six pack, it's very hard because you become the average of the five people that you talk to the most. And if you do not have an online business, probably the hardest thing to do is start an online business when the five people that you talk with the most don't have an online business. That's why I literally moved to Bali because you could see, I mean, I literally talked to people like this 11 year old girl that turned on $30 million, this guy that makes a million dollars from profit, in their reality, Starting an online business is very easy because everyone here has an online business here in Bali, right? But when I was first getting started and I was stuck like in an occupation that I did not enjoy, right? Like in this cubicle, right? I did not know anybody who had an online business. So one of the first things that I needed to do was literally be put in front of those people. So, I mean, think about it. There's so many different business models. We talk about them on my channel. We even have a free 77 cheat sheet guide on what business models are good for you. Um, but what you guys gotta understand is when you have a business model, you can literally go to Facebook and Facebook groups and type in that business model and then group and join a bunch of these groups for free. So what I did back in the day is I was joining like drop shipping groups, affiliate marketing groups, e-commerce groups, uh, branding groups, uh, like webinar groups. And I just saw like what businesses existed out there and people were like posting all the things for free and I was like, oh my God, this is crazy. So I literally messaged them and I'm like, thank you so much for posting that. And I said thank you to as many people as possible and out of nowhere, I started building connections and relationships for people that were doing six figures online that I've never met in person but I've met like in the interwebs and I just started spending all my time talking to them, right, on like Facebook Messenger. And I was like, oh my God, how did you do this? And then I'm like learning from them and I'm like, well, what courses did you take? And they would tell me and then I'd be like, okay, well, how did I do this? I have this problem. 
how do I overcome this? Because these people had the problem that I'm already facing right now, so I could ask them. I'm not gonna ask my mom and dad that don't know this specific problem for this business model, because they're like, Michael, go back to school, because they're super Filipino, right? Like they don't know the answer to this thing. So the first step, if you wanna start an online business, you gotta look at your environment. Who are you talking to? If you're, the five people that you talk to the most do not have an online business, I recommend try finding five people on the internet where you could go ahead and talk to. That's how people in our community were able to succeed. Like for example, Dina, a stay-at-home mom at age 47 years old, was able to go to zero to 30 grand in five to eight weeks with no experience. Do you think she was able to start an online business and work from home if all of her friends were like, babe, you don't have to go ahead and start an online business. Just, you know, like, you know, get a job, just do it because it's safe, it's secure. No, it's because she surrounded herself in our community and you can see this is how all these people were able to go ahead and succeed as well in our like secret little Illuminati community, right? Once you go ahead and understand that, what I ended up doing is I found multiple business models to go ahead and learn from, from people that already had the results that I wanted. One of them was like one of the most simplest and easiest business models. If you literally go to eBay and type in hardtop gazebo and you see this thing right here, literally open it, you will see this product right here. This product is a thousand dollars, literally a thousand dollars. Okay, so imagine this. I, I literally, and you don't need your own gazebo. I don't need to go ahead and store all these and like in my backyard and like ship it and then make money that way. Like, check this out. This exact same gazebo with the exact same picture exists on Walmart for three hundred dollars less. Three hundred dollars less. Oh, Mike, don't I have to buy. No, 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 no. You don't. Because what I did is I copied and pasted these pictures onto eBay, and I would just wait for a sale. The moment I would get a sale, kind of like fishing, you kind of like start reeling it in. You get the money up front and the shipping details. So I took the money up front and the shipping details, would go to Walmart, click add to cart, put in the information of my customer and their name and where to ship it. And then when it came time to the money, I just used their money to go ahead and buy it. Does that make sense? So literally that's what I was doing it over and over and over again to make my first $100 a day profit. But then remember, I, I was in this network of people that were also doing similar things. Like this was just one of the like Facebook groups that I was part of. And I was like, well, how did you also increase your profit? And they're like, oh, we actually increased our profit by cash back and travel awards points. What do you mean? Well, he was like, do you know there's like some websites like topcashback.com or racketing.com where you click on one extra button before going to Walmart, you can get 1%, 2%, 3%, 4%, even 5% cash back. I'm like, are you serious? They're like, yeah. Like imagine every $100 you spend of your customer's money, you get $5 for free. And I'm like, that's, that's free money. He's like, yeah, you just click on one extra button. I was like, okay, I wouldn't have not known that if I didn't go into the community. Does that make sense? That's what community is, everything. And you wanna go ahead and start an online business. And they're like, well, what else do you do? And he's like, oh, I use X, Y, and Z travel credit card because then we get the most amount of points for this. Our customer pays off the credit card bill so we don't have to. We profit and we get a bunch of free travel points so we can stay in business class for free or in hotels for free. And I'm like, that's amazing. You're telling me I could go into hotels for free and fly business class for free? I'm like, yeah. So I literally used that and then lived in Vegas in a hotel for 30 days, okay? What other person was able to do that for free? Okay, literally because of go, like going ahead and doing this. And this method alone got me to like $100 a day profit, okay? $100 a day profit. And the reason why that's important is for me, right? Number one, I'd never been successful online before. I was successful some ways offline in like sales and like, like learning cold calling because I had to because I was just trying to find any like business model. But like, again, I ended up failing because like it wasn't long term. This was the first thing that gave me $100 a day profit consistently. Why is that very important? Because think about this, right? Your goal with your first baby like online business is to just build the belief that you could make a sale online and number two, make some money. And when I was making $100 a day profit, right? And I was getting the $100 a day profit and I didn't have to go like work at a job and I could literally stay in the comforts of my own home and I won back my time. What started happening is I started having the time to think Right? Just imagine this, you have an online business, you make $100 a day profit, you don't have to work in a nine to five job, you're literally at home, everyone that you know is at a job, and now you just have alone time to think. Now remember, I was like a part of all these like groups, so guess what I did with my free time? I got stuck at $100 a day with, my business mo with this business model because that was kind of like the cap of it because it's free to get started, there's a lot of competition that could easily come in. So I started getting the time to think and I was like, okay, with this luxury of time to think, I was like, What's gonna be my next business model, right? How can I actually make more money while working literally less? And that's when I kind of like switched over to like affiliate marketing because I realized, well, there are literally companies and businesses where, you know, they'll do the sales, 
They'll do the delivery, they'll do the customer service, they'll literally do everything. They'll spend millions of dollars with their own inventory. And all I gotta do is do a little bit of the marketing and I still get paid most of the money. So when I started getting $100 a day profit, I started realizing that the skill that I needed to learn was marketing. The moment I'm in the community that understands like how to succeed and I'm in there, what I've realized in all of these communities was the skill that they developed the most that they made sure that they had to grow every single year was their marketing skill. Why? Because if you understand how to market, you could sell any product. If you can sell any product, do you really need to necessarily create the product? Because if it takes time and energy to create a product, someone else has already spent their time and energy and money creating a product. I do not have to do that. There's an infinite amount of products that I could go ahead and sell. If I know marketing, I could literally sell anything. And you can see this is literally what I did. I took a product that was not mine and I was able to go ahead and sell it. Right, you can see this, $346,000 not commission. People in our community were able to take a product that they've never seen before, that they don't have to spend a single dollar on to do the shipping, handling, the customer service. They don't have to build a company. And they went from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks. The only reason why you're able to do that is because you kind of outsource everything else and you focus on one job, which is marketing. And you want, if you wanna know the exact skill that they learned to go ahead and do this in a complete step-by-step -step blueprint, then sign up for this week's free workshop below. Check out this video, this podcast video. See you guys later, woo!